Costa Mesa was once just a rural farming community, but today it is known as the City of Arts. Hard to imagine it as a rural farming committee. It has a world-class arts and culture scene and so much more to enjoy. And it's just one mile from the Pacific Coast in the heart of Orange County. Sheba Turk is there this morning live to highlight the best of Costa Mesa and share some of its history. Sheba, good morning. Good morning, Ruta Bay and Marcy. That's right, this morning we are all about the city of arts. If you love the arts, performing arts, theater, you want to come to Costa Mesa. They have the best of the best. The Segerstrom Center for Arts is where we are this morning. Casey Ritz is the president. He's joining us to tell us more about it. Thanks for being with us this morning. Thank you, thank you. You know, we're, us theater people aren't used to being up at 7 in the morning, <laughs> so this is, a, this is a different experience, but we're delighted you're here. Well, thank you for waking up <laughs> early for KCAL. We wanted to show the best of Costa Mesa, and so we yeah. started here this morning. This is such a beautiful facility first. Kind of tell us where we're standing. Yeah, I mean, this is the original building built in 1986. Mm -hmm. This is the, the Segerstrom Hall. Uh, we are committed to providing the best of the performing arts in Costa Mesa and having a, a worldwide reputation for that. Uh, we have significant education programs, community engagement, and this is really our home for for international dance and Broadway. We have, I think you mentioned, we have Tina, the Tina Turner musical in here right now. Mm -hmm. We have an amazing partnership with American Ballet Theater where we do Nutcracker every year. We do a world premiere ballet every year. We just did like Water for Chocolate. Hopefully, hopefully many of your, uh, your viewers have read that book or seen that movie. Uh -huh. uh, but this is really the centerpiece built in 1986. And then this is the Henry and Renee Segerstrom Concert Hall that was built in 2006. And we have three amazing resident companies, the Pacific Symphony, the Philharmonic Society of Orange County, and the Pacific Chorale. And this is really the home of all those amazing companies. But we also do a lot of amazing work. We have Patti Lapone, Tony, multi-Tony winner Patti Lapone mm -hmm. coming. And on the other side of the building, we have uh, international film star Jeff Goldblum coming at the end of the month. So this is one of our crown jewels, and we're really, really proud of it. It has some of the best acoustics around. You can't you can't hear music in any venue better than this one. Yep. It's fabulous. This is really amazing. I was telling them a little bit of the history earlier with Henry Segerstrom. Well, yeah, Henry, you know, these this, these were lima bean farms. I mean, when, when I started this job in 2019, one of the first things they gave me was a big bag of lima beans. Wow. And if you just go a couple of blocks that way, you can see what it used to look like. But... Henry donated the land, really uh, was an amazing visionary and wanted the best of the performing arts to happen in Costa Mesa, awesome. to happen in Orange County. And look at what we have. It's look like Look at what it is today. Casey, thank you so much for explaining more for us, guys. We're going to show you more of Costa Mesa this morning, so stick with us. All right, Shiva, thanks so much.